cousin Larry and I are going to do a little song that Barney wrote. It was my favorite one. I always told him it was probably one of the better ones that he'd done. I remember uh, he sent about six, seven songs off to have them rated, and they would rate them one to five, five being the best. I told him, I said, this song here, this is going to be the best one. And sure enough, it come back, it was the best one. Five star. I know Barney liked him a muscadine. He had them on the shirts, and he ate them off the trees down here. Wrote about them. And that's what this one's about. It's called Sucking on a Muscadine. On a piece of tin to dry. I can still smell them mule ears as it's made in the family pride. Memories recalled as a child go back some time ago. Dropping them hogs, running them dogs, still hear the rooster crow. Road right on a mule or a tar swing and five young'uns at a time. Skinny dipping down at a swimming hole, climbing up a knotty pine. Had a lot of fun from the things we've done, and it never cost us a dime. Like propped up against an old pine stump, sucking on a muscadine. Sit on the mossy bank with their toes playing in the creek. No one minded where was at or no deadline to keep. The mountains in the fall, the whippoorwills call, I smell a honeysuckle vine. Propped up against an old pine stump, sucking on a muscadine. Saturday night when the moon was right and her prayers had all been said. Daddy get a jar from an old junk car and a fiddle underneath the bed. Bluegrass will flow from the harbor below as I recall my favorite line. About propping up against an old pine stump, sucking on a muscadine. Well, that has been some time ago, well, almost 40 years. Some things still remain the same while others disappear. But the creek's still in the holler when you get to feeling low. And you need some time to clear your mind, you know just where to go. Mossy bank with her toes playing in the creek. And no one minded where was at or no deadline to keep. The mountains in the fall, the whippoorwills call, I smell a honeysuckle vine. Propped up against an old pine stump, sucking on a muscadine.
band up here. Pick a little bit and uh, get Jared. I say it's kind of, I thought it's kind of ironic myself. He turned out to be Barney's son in law. <laughs> After starting with us, what was she, 16, 17? 16? He's grown up now. Married to Miss Debbie, a daughter there. Yes, sir. You ready? I knew that thing, he'd find a way to hit me with that fiddle bow. <laughs> <laughs> 